You ain't happy for me. 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 Welcome back, everybody. You already know this your girl, Heaven Sent. I want to thank all y'all for fucking with me. Now, this is going to be your sexy blackout. Keep in mind the purpose of this read is to give you insights on a particular situation, dealing with a certain person that you could be intimate with at the moment. Keep in mind this read is general and it may not resonate with no damn body. You see what I'm saying? Now, let me tap right in because energies is going on for this sexy blackout it's like okay i feel like something is bothering you and whoever you dealing with knows that like this person is like finna come in towards you and try to figure out what the fuck is going on because see you may have switched up a little bit like you still the same with this person but it's something that's like kind of not normal you know what i'm saying like this person knows something is bothering you and you may not speak on it you may have threw a clue out but you not you you haven't fully talked about it you know what i'm saying and this person knows something is bothering you right now so I feel like you could be just trying to heal through this or, you know, not think too deep or not get over emotional. Um, Cause I feel like you feel in a certain type of way towards a particular person, you know what I'm saying? And this person knows something is bothering you, but they may just don't know to what extent, extent it, it, it is bothering you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, if I said that shit right, but you know the length of how fucked up some shit is but yeah this person knows something is is kind of like not right with you and them you know um it's like right now you kind of loving yourself and trusting yourself you know what i'm saying like you not really focused on this person at this particular moment it, it's kind of just like you know what i'm finna just do me do what the fuck i want to do like i'm not really interested right now to even be bothered you know or want to be around this person at this time because i feel like this person is okay see this what a deceit come in at because sometimes this person i feel like say things and don't deliver you know like their actions do not match up with their words it's it's almost like okay they say one thing and then it's the opposite of what the fuck they say it's it's like see that type of shit uh, motherfuckers ain't, ain't can't really f take it serious can't really fuck with like if you call you know if they call themselves this you know loyal dedicated type of motherfucker i got your back and all of this but don't never come through don't never fall through that's where the problem is coming in and that's kind of like what's bothering you you know what i'm saying i feel like they know but they don't think that it's really affecting how you really feel about this person it's like you know what almost at, at this point it's like you know what i don't even want to fuck with you no more it's getting to that level it's getting to that level i feel like and this person knows something is, is about to happen that's going to be kind of life-changing because it's like when you do so much for a person and you put so much energy into a person and, and it's like you always there for a person but when it comes to you type shit and it's like damn 
when it's time to return the energy or or something like that it's like okay you you always get the short end of the stick or it's always an issue or it's always a delay or it's always i got you and all that type of shit motherfuckers get tired of it they get tired of it so it, it, that's kind of like something where it's bothering you at you know what i'm saying motherfuckers ain't never following through for you they ain't never coming through for you you know um i feel like this person is i see this person coming in with some type of flowers and, and trying to make something right here because it's it's like this person is going to try everything they're going to try their hardest to, to try to fix this put it like that it's like they're going to be trying to use every power every energy something to try to fix this because it's kind of fucked up and they know it's bothering you you know what I'm saying? It's bothering you because you could be the type that don't ask this motherfucker for shit. You know what I'm saying? You don't ask this person for anything. And then when it comes down to something maybe special, they don't come through. It affects you because it's kind of like you don't value me because I value myself type shit. So if you don't value me and I value myself, what the fuck that leaves you at? You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like that type of shit here. But it's like, okay, the overall is like this person is going to try their hardest to try to like make up for some shit or, or um, try to make it right or try to fix whatever this energy is that's kind of fucked up. Like they fucked up. They did. And it's so much things that they want to say that they just don't know how to say it and it could come off kind of like aggressive a little bit or kind of moody or just a person all in their feelings and, and something like that like they don't want to see they don't want to be seen a certain way with, through communication so it's kind of like they probably say something or think it to themselves and just don't really deliver it you know what i'm saying and then when they do see you it may come out a little aggressive you know what i'm saying so this person could be like a little aggressive towards you because it's kind of like they frustrated with the fact that something is bothering you but it may be little to them it may be petty to them but it's not petty to you if this shit is making sense because the situation is kind of like okay i don't trust this i don't trust you i can't trust what you say um yeah it's kind of like you over it you know what i'm saying you over it mentally dealing with it because it's like damn if i'm everything to you if I'm everything for you, like if I if I'm just dream come true, this fantasy, like whatever you ask for, I do, I get, or whatever the case may be. But then when it turns around and it's like, okay, I'm asking for something, it's like you don't come through. It's kind of like this this person is the situation is kind of like okay, you're everything to them, but they're kind of like nothing to you. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like that type of shit here, and like this person try to you know try to be cold or be detached a little bit or, or or try you know what i'm saying it's a form of trying through communication it's something that they're trying to do behind the scenes but it's not working because this person got too much love you know what i'm saying it's 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 an emotional attachment here where it's like you just don't feel appreciated you don't feel appreciated. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't really teach a motherfucker how to love you. You know what I'm saying? It's just not going to happen. It's just, just like, okay, well, you know, you, just long as this person, okay, you know how love feels. So, once that shit is gone, they're going to be the ones sitting there looking stupid. Because I feel like the foundation it's it's like a private privacy it's kind of private it's kind of low-key and emotionally you may just not be happy you know what i'm saying you may have kept this to yourself you may you know what i'm saying like you keep certain shit to yourself dealing with the situation and the way you probably truly feel about it is like i'm not feeling it you know i'm not feeling it right now like no like at one point you did love the, this person or you did have feelings for the situation but now it's kind of like you just don't even want to be around it because it's just too low vibe for you it's just not vibing with you like you do things for this person this person don't do shit for you so it's kind of like why am i even here you know what i'm saying what's the point 
What's the point? It's all coming from this feeling of like you freeing your energy from it. You know what I'm saying? Because you're not around this person like that. Like you free. Like you don't even want to be around this person. That's how fucked up it is. That's how bothering this situation is. Where it's like, you know what? I don't even want to be around this person. Like if this person is there, I'm gone. It's kind of like that. You know what I'm saying? You don't need this person for anything. And you know this and they know this. They know it. You don't need them. I feel like you looking at the situation like you probably ain't even, you know, care to even have sex with this person at this time. It's like this person could be trying to say little things to try to, you know, put their foot down or control some shit. Or, but that shit ain't working. You don't give a fuck at this point. Like you've reached a point dealing with it where it's like i don't give a fuck what you do you know it's it's like because you done all you could do and you still not happy with the situation so it's like i don't care like you could go do whatever the fuck you want to do you know what i'm saying because obviously ain't shit working it's 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 you you know what i'm saying you the toxic no nothing low vibrational selfish you know what I'm saying? It, it all comes back to this person and how they are and how fucked up they are and how they take things for granted. But see, this person going to get a wake up call. They're going to get a wake up call dealing with this situation because the gratitude, you're going to hear a lot of thank you and I appreciate you. This motherfucker probably going to write a speech around this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Because certain, certain motherfuckers, you don't take for granted. You don't do them dirty. You don't overlook. It's like if a motherfucker come through for you, you know what I'm saying? You better appreciate a motherfucker. Show a motherfucker how much a, a, you appreciate them. Like, don't overlook them. Don't dismiss them. Don't think, oh, you know, a motherfucker got it. They don't, they don't really care. You don't know what the fuck a motherfucker is thinking. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like that. Like, damn, you know? Like, I, sh you probably feel like I should be the first motherfucker that you do anything for type shit. You know what I'm saying? When it comes down to certain shit. Like, what the fuck? Like, oh, but it's cool. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. Because motherfuckers going to get a wake-up call dealing with, shit, with certain shit. Like, don't get it fucked up. Like, because you could have been the only motherfucker that really came through for a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? And then they be trying to play you and shit. That shit don't go well. Like, you playing the wrong... Matter of fact, you playing with the right one. Because this type of shit is going to teach you a fucking lesson about yourself. You know? It's kind of like that. Now, <laughs> this energy is leading this person, like... They're going to realize how much in love they are. How much... They took you for granted, dismissed you. You know what I'm saying? They're going to realize that type of shit because, see, you're not going to be available. You know, you're not there. Your energy is not there. You don't fucking care. You know what I'm saying? Once you stop, stop giving a fuck, that's when it's like, oh, shit, it, it's a, motherfuckers world start crashing the fuck down because you stopped giving a fuck. You know what I'm saying? So the, what that tell you about yourself? You know, you a cold motherfucker. You a bad motherfucker. Like this type of person, you can find a dime a dozen dealing with. It's another one on every corner. You know what I'm saying? This ain't nothing special. I feel like. It's just a motherfucker thought it was sweet. And you know it was sweet. Of course. Look at you. It's sweet. It ain't bitter. It ain't sour. <laughs> yeah, it's sweet. Surely is. But once it's gone, it's kind of like, damn. What happened? Like, motherfuckers start having anxiety, panic attacks, and don't know what the fuck going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't got no boost. That sugar. So it's kind of like that. This person is going to realize that. It's going to be a fear. 
it's going to be a fear put in their fucking heart of like losing you to another motherfucker they're afraid they're going to lose you to somebody else and that's what's going to happen <laughs> why wouldn't it happen like what you think you're going to be able what well, they think they're going to be able to just treat you all any kind of way forever like don't they think like you want more and you deserve more and you're going to get more <laughs> like they don't think somebody else is going to come in and be like you know what i got you you know what i'm saying like i'm gonna treat you how you want to be treated you know it's kind of like that like they're gonna be afraid of that they're gonna be so afraid of that that happening that it's gonna happen they're gonna manifest that for you <laughs> by their thoughts you pretty much ain't gotta do shit they're gonna manifest it for you because they, they they fucked up they played you you know what i'm saying they're gonna come begging they're gonna be begging they're gonna be begging for your forgiveness they're gonna be like i'm sorry i didn't appreciate you i know you felt like that and this can we fix it and all of this shit and it's like man listen i don't even know if, if, if the words is 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 the words coming out of your mouth is real you know what i'm saying it's like you at this point dealing with it like man i don't i'm cool you know like we could be cool i'm cool on this type of shit like ain't nobody to be going through another cycle of this shit so yeah that's pretty much all i got hopefully that shit just made sense of the fuck up drop a comment let me know what the fuck going on around this bitch and i'll see you on the next one peace out